getting all bundled up, ready to go outside, heading to the city today. I have a crazy day planned today. Tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. flight to Fort Lauderdale, Florida, then to Boca, then to Miami, then back to Tel Aviv. But today, now heading into the city, meeting David Mann, an old friend, kind of catching up, it's gonna be great. After that, meeting Morgan Stanley. It's gonna be interesting, to say the least. Meeting Peter Cash later on, a uh, best-selling author who writes about business and other things. And a couple other meetings throughout the day. And then tonight, tonight is a fundraiser, which is supposed to be last week, but was postponed because of the storm. So that's gonna be at uh, Jesselson Capital. Michael Jesselson will host. So I'm super excited to uh, be speaking there about Israeli tech last night. APAC was great. All in all, uh, you know, if Florida goes as smoothly as New York went, I can say this, uh, this trip was, uh, I can sum it up with saying that this trip was pretty effective and relatively smooth. You know, it's never easy living out of a suitcase for a week, but other than that, everybody's been super nice and it's just gone pretty smoothly. But I am very, very excited to go back to Israel. All right, heading outside, wish me luck. It's cold. Oh yeah, and how did I forget? In between the meetings I mentioned, I'm going to meet my friend at MasterCard. Israel I haven't seen in 15 years. He's a hotshot at MasterCard. It's gonna be nuts, back to back to back all day. Then this fundraiser, coming back, packing out my stuff, which is all over the place right now. And then 6 a.m. flight to Florida. It's gonna be intense. Okay, cover me. I'm going out. Just made it into the very, very cold NYC. Who are you, sir? This good looking guy dressed all fancy. Who are you? David Mann. How long do we know each other? I think we know each other going back 20 years at this point. Probably more than that. More than that. Where do I know you from? I guess originally Riverdale. Wow, that must be 30 or 40 years. Yeah, no, not 40 because I'm 39, but I mean, I've been in Israel 25 years, so it's definitely more than 20. And uh, what do you do? See, how, how fast can you can you sum this up since we're about to go into the parking lot? <laughs> what do you do? I'm part of Alex Brown's senior management team. I run their private institutional client group. And Alex Brown and on, on one leg, as they say, what's Alex Brown? The oldest investment bank in America. Wow, that's quite a, I think, I think nothing more to add. A that's, boutique broker dealer. Love it. And you're a big, big believer, I think, if we sum up this conversation with the past hour, you're a big believer in selflessly and unconditionally giving business, giving. Pay it forward, tech's just the right place to do it. But pay it forward not, I think, again, I think we agree, correct me if I'm wrong, not for the sake of good karma, but for the sake of actually good business. It's good business to, to behave that way. I think everyone believes in an investment to generate a yield. That investment can be an investment in time. There's no question that that will always have a, a benefit that pays off later, whether that's monetary or otherwise. But Love it different sources of value. I love it, and this is exactly what I'm writing the book about, and that is, forget karma. If you give and you facilitate success for others, you end up going down the road to success. Love it. Thank you so much for the ride to the city, man. Appreciate it, it's Absolutely. awesome to catch up. Love it. My pleasure. It. All right, cool. Do microphones freeze? Is that a thing? Because my microphone feels frozen, as does my tripod, by the way. It is so damn cold. And the fact that I'm holding this camera in front of me right now is a real sacrifice. Do you appreciate it? <laughs> to the airport at 4 a.m. to Florida. I'm calling it a day because I'm exhausted. See you tomorrow.